Hello friends, welcome to Dial Android YouTube channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to factory reset your Samsung Galaxy S4. Well, they will be making two videos for it. One, when your phone is able to switch on and working and you want, just want to reset your phone. And the other one is by going to Android recovery mode. So the first one is, if your phone is working, you just want to reset it, go to the settings and click on accounts, backup and reset, and click on factory data reset. And if you want, you can even format your SD card. This is not the external SD, it's the internal SD card. And you just need to reset device, delete all. So this way, yeah, it will wipe off everything on your phone and uh, do a factory reset. So you can see it's now booting up. So in this way, yeah, if your phone is working, you can just go ahead and format your phone if mm -hmm. you feel that there, there are some extra data you want to clean up or it's not working properly. So once you, it boots after this, it will take a little time. So here you go. You can see it's uh, doing the erase. Because what basically it do, does is when you click on there, it go to recovery mode automatically and erase everything. Well, we have a manual way of doing it, which I'll show you in the next mm -hmm. video. So now the process is complete. Now it's booting up. Since it's a first boot after reset, it will take some time to set up the files and all, and it will ask for initial setup again. You see, since this is the at and version of phone, you, you, you're seeing the at and logo, and it will stuck on this point for some time, maybe half a minute. Your phone should be ready within a minute or two. So yeah, we have skipped that portion of the video. Now your phone is reset and you can see the welcome screen again. You have to set up your phone. And in this way, you can just easily reset your phone. Well, thanks for watching guys. Stay tuned for next video in which we I'll show you how to go to Android recovery mode and manage do it. That will be very useful if your phone is not able to switch on properly or it's not functioning. Thanks a lot guys. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to our YouTube channel.